guys. Oh, that's a lot of energy in that kind of made me lose my breath because I was running up and down the stairs. Welcome back or welcome me back. I have been MIA for a while. There has been a lot of transitions in my life the past couple months, but I will go over that maybe in a different video if I feel up to it. But um, today's video is going to be about my favorite grooming essentials, specifically pants and shoes. I just feel like these two accessories for groomers are really hard to come by and a good pair that's nice and also pretty and comfortable is just hard to find. So I wanted to share with you guys the ones that I use. So my first favorite are these pants. They are essentially hiking pants. Um, I got it from Amazon. It's about $30 or so. Very um, affordable. And I think it's called our Dooku pants. And um, it is made out of 90% um, nylon and 10% spandex. So it has um, a good stretch to it and it's very comfortable. It's great at resisting water so I have um, bathed a lot of like big hairy dogs with these and when they shake it gets all over my pants um, they don't my pants don't get like super wet and if they do like it dries insanely fast so I love that it's also just super lightweight and breathable um, it doesn't get dirty like that quickly I this might be a little bit gross but I can probably get away with wearing it like three days in a row, just depending on like how many dirty dogs you do and how many like nail grindings you do. But um, what I do every, like after every shift is I just blow off my, my body with the velocity dryer and just kind of get all of that um, dust and grime out of there. And it's, it's pretty, it's pretty awesome. It's just, like I love it and you can wear it high-waisted if you're into that and low-waisted if you want it. It has this stretchable uh, waistband on it and you can also have um, a belt if you want to put a belt to just reinforce the that part. And pockets have zippers on them so it's great so if you get tips or you know want to put anything that won't fall out it's just the perfect um, pocket to have everything be secure and I also have um, and it has a, a back pocket too so I put my phone here and stuff and I zip it up and it's good to go so this is just my favorite pants to wear I have like five of these because I love them so much and I just kind of wanted to make sure that I have a lot on hand just in case it was gonna sell out or get discontinued I wanted to have um, extra pairs um, when, you know, just to be on the safe side because it's it's really hard to find pants that look good and also feel good and actually like performs well. So I think these pants are the best ones hands down that I have tried. I used to wear just, you know, like workout pants, but like they, they just have a different material where it it just soaked up so much water and it didn't dry very fast, um, got dirty super easily, the nail dust would stick to it, hair would poke through. Hair does not poke through here, like it's amazing. And um, also the smell, like it, you know what I'm talking about since most of you that are watching this are probably groomers, but um, the smell of dogs like doesn't stay on as much on this type of fabric and I think that's just awesome so you can just wear it like multiple times if you, if you feel like it um, I don't think that's bad because I mean that's my dog walking around so it doesn't get dirty as fast as other pants and um, it doesn't irritate your skin because it's not close up or pressed up against your um, leg because I used to wear I sometimes still wear, if I, if I feel fancy, um, I would wear like my skinny jeans um, 
to twerk, but they it just hair just pokes through and it just doesn't feel nice. Um, so the second favorite I have are grooming boots. And the boots that I'm talking about are the Suave Chelsea boots by Boggs. And it's, I, I mean, I've worn these, so they're a little bit dirty. They're new, but they're dirty. It is this. <laughs> it's this. Um, the only thing that is not too great about this is that they don't have half sizes because I am typically always at eight and a half, but most rain boots anyways come in whole sizes. So I've been getting nines and they are a little bit big. So what I do is I take, I'm going to take my insert out. It might be gross, but I have like these Dr. Scholl's. I know this is, it, it's, it's used. I know it's used. It might be gross, but I just wanted to show you the insert of it because I have high arches, so it's great for a high arch and it has like a really nice cushion for your feet. And so since it's a little bit bigger, this um, gives it enough room where my feet don't slide around too much and it is just perfectly comfortable in here. Oh my gosh, put it, excuse me. I love these boots because it's easy to put on easy to take off, it's waterproof, um, and it's comfortable. It's really comfortable and also super lightweight. They are a bit on the pricey side. They're almost 100 bucks. They're around 89 to, I think it was around $89, but I think it's well worth it and not even that expensive for something that you are gonna pretty much wear every day and I haven't, I've been looking for boots that are comfortable and that won't slip and that, you know, just actually does what it's supposed to do because I have tried on a lot of rain boots and they were either just too tight, too rubbery, squeaks, and um, you still slip and it wasn't that comfortable, um, but this checks all the boxes and it's my second pair of them and um, they are my number one choice and I will probably repurchase it over and over. And I love the Chelsea style because it's, I think it's just, um, easier to maneuver, um, your way with dogs rather than the ones that's like up to your calves. So I think the Chelsea ones are perfect for grooming because you have a little bit more mobility, um, to just, you know do what you gotta do. Um, there is a second pair of boots. I don't have it here because um, it got old and I needed to throw it away. And it is the, I think the Tom Sperry, the Sperry boots, uh, the duck boots. They're almost just as comfortable. It's not as of a thick sole as Boggs has. Like this one, it's pretty thick, like inside. Like, is it the sole? Like the sole of the shoe? or the rain boot is pretty thick, so that's what makes it really comfortable. So the Sperry duck boots um, are a little bit thinner, but they're pretty comfortable. You just need to put the inserts and you're good to go. So I would highly, highly recommend if you are looking for a good pair of grooming pants or even just hiking boots or hiking boots um, or hiking pants, um, I would go with the RG Goo Pants, and if you're looking for a great pair of rain boots, I would go with these bogs right over here. And yeah, so that's it. <laughs>